God, I love history. Well, I'm in Newtown, Pennsylvania, which is, oh, about 40 minutes northeast of Philly. Just ate at a restaurant called Rocco's. I just had the uh, broken leg of lamb. So tonight I have two sold out shows at the Newtown Theater, and this theater has a lot of history. Uh, Newtown Theater has an extensive history dating back to 1831. Wow. Pretty cool, huh? A lot of history here. Look at this house. You know this has been around a while. They don't make them like this anymore. Newtown's a very quiet town. It's like, it's like going back in time. It really is nice. I'm at Ned's Cigar Store here in Newtown, PA. I get a chance to enjoy a nice cigar without Lucy breaking my balls. Wow, wow. What do I know about the restaurant business? And how to sit down and order a meal? Comedy shows coming in November. Everybody's a fucking comedian now. Loyalist raid of 1778. On February 19th, 1778, while the British occupied Philadelphia, some 40 armed loyalists raided the tavern here. The fighting left five American soldiers dead, four wounded, 11 captured. Taylors here were making uniforms for use at Valley Forge and 2,000 yards of cloth were lost. God, I love history. And then we fast forward to these poor souls who gave their lives. Private Thomas Weinkoop, U.S. Navy, American Civil War. Here's another one, Newtown, hometown hero, First Sergeant Kenneth B. Elwell, U.S. Army, Afghanistan. Unbelievable. Since the beginning of time, we've been in wars. Unreal. Thank you for your service, buddy. Look at this mom and pop hardware store, right? Fuck Home Depot. Technician first class George F. Hennessy, United States Army, World War II. Must be turning in his grave. Douglas A. Post, U.S. Navy, Vietnam. Second Lieutenant Morrell Smith, World War I. They all fought for the people behind me having ice cream. And behind me is the bed and breakfast where I'll be staying tonight. And 100 years from now, there'll be a plaque in that wall that's, that'll say, Vic DiBetetto rubbed one out here before his two sold-out shows at the Newtown Theater. That's the time the Titanic sunk. When's the last time you saw this? An actual key. None of that electronic nonsense. One key for both locks. If I see two little twin girls at the end of this hallway, I'm getting the fuck out of here. This is Abe Lincoln's deathbed. I know it. Those are those two twin girls from The Shining. This room, 232, 237, what was it? Gotta love the AC. That'll be enough to cool my left testicle. But my friend Carmine DeMarco did all the tiling in this bathroom. Nice. There's the shower from Psycho. I knew that guy in the front desk was a little too, uh, something wasn't right with him. Something about his mother, I don't know. 